What's happening team? Welcome back to another video. My name is Ben Prentice, I'm an online coach and a personal trainer. I'm 24 years old and I compete in natural bodybuilding. Um, I've actually been lucky enough to be asked by my sponsor MyProtein to help you guys through a home workout, alright? The reason we're doing a home workout is pretty obvious. Every gym is now closed due to the virus. Um, so that's exactly why we're going to do this. My plan for this workout is going to be a very, very, very minimum equipment needed workout, alright? So some dumbbells, some resistance bands, and then possibly a few other things that I find around the house. But we're just going to crack on, it's going to be a shoulder focused workout. This is a workout that I'm going to be doing over the next coming weeks. Uh, hopefully it's not going to be months until the gym's reopen. But again guys, all we need to focus on is doing what we can, alright? Now, one thing I want to say before we do start this workout is, even though you're not in a gym environment, one thing you can still make sure you do is train very, very hard, alright? So, yes, it's going to be a very high rep, high volume, high intensity workout with minimal rest times, alright? We're trying to accumulate as much volume and fatigue in the muscles as we can and then we'll see how it goes, alright? So I shall see you guys for exercise one. So guys, exercise number one is going to be a dumbbell seated shoulder press, alright? I've got my dumbbells here, I've got this nice little couch that I'm going to be sitting on and does not have a support on the back, so please be aware of this and keep your core muscles nice and tight, alright? I have also added a resistance band under this couch just to add maximum tension at the top of the movement because my dumbbells are not heavy enough, alright? The goal here is to try and get that 8 to 10 rep range. Again, if the weight is too light, we're going to just go to failure, alright? So close to that, possibly 12 to 15. It could even be up to the 20 to 25 rep ranges, alright? With home workouts, we don't have a gym, we don't have the heaviest weight possible. So we're just trying to create as much tension in the muscle as possible. So exercise number two is going to be an elevated feet press up sort of position, alright? Um, you could do a handstand push up if you can, I don't think I can and I'm definitely not going to risk it especially on camera for you. So what I want you to try and do is just elevate your feet enough so that we can focus on pressing through the front delts and not the chest, alright? Now moving on to exercise number three. Exercise number three is going to be a side lateral raise. All right, so working the side delt here. Always on side delts. Me personally, I prefer working in a higher rep range. I think the side delts respond so much better to a higher rep range. All right. So we're actually going to do another variation of a side lateral movement. Now it's going to be a resistance band cuffed single arm side raise movement, alright? The reason we're using cuffs is going to take pressure off the wrist joint, put more focus on the side delt, alright? And we're just doing a single arm. I've actually put the resistance bands under the door that I'll show you right now. Um, it comes with a little under door attachment just so we can lift it from the bottom up across our body. Again, one thing we need to focus on here is when we're doing home exercises and things that aren't too heavy, I really, really, really want you to focus on what muscle you're actually using, alright? So focus on the side delt, so try and pull using your side delt, alright? So guys, next exercise is going to be a superset, alright? So we're going to be doing one exercise, then no rest, then straight into a second exercise, alright? We're going to be focusing on the front delts for the first exercise, and then the rear delts for the second exercise, alright? All we're going to be using here is a resistance band. We're going to wrap the resistance band under our feet. We're going to be doing front raises for the first superset. For the second exercise, 
we're going to be doing band pull apart. So here, get the band nice and tight. We're focusing on pulling outwards, working on those rear delts, all right? We're going to go to failure on both these sets. Front raise to failure, rear delt to failure. 30 seconds rest, four sets of this. Second last exercise guys to finish off the shoulder workout, we're going to be doing a face pull variation alright, so what I've done is I've wrapped the resistance band around the door handle, um, please 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 be careful with this, I didn't want to hear anybody getting hurt in the face with a resistance band, that would not be ideal, so just please be careful, if you can secure it with anything or tie it with something that would be even better alright, so please be very very cautious with this. So we've got a band here, get the tension nice and tight, again chest upright, I want you to focus on pulling through the elbows. Focusing on those rear delts as well. Again, nice and slow, we're going to go for a higher rep range in this. So team, final exercise of today is going to be a dumbbell shrug, alright, we're going to be working the traps here, I'm going to be doing it seated, I'm also going to be wrapping a resistance band around my feet, alright, um, again, the biggest thing here is squeezing, squeezing, squeezing at the top and control and stretch all the way down, alright, keep that core nice and tight, try and stay as upright as possible. So team, that is the end of our shoulder workout from home using dumbbells and some resistance bands. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you give the video a thumbs up. Please subscribe to the channel. Comment down below if you did enjoy it. Um, you can find me at Ben Penis Fitness on Instagram. I also have my own YouTube channel that is linked in my Instagram. So I hope you hear. I hope I hear from you all soon. Please stay safe and keep on training, guys. All right. Cheers.